I've seen a lot of questions on updating Lightroom and Photoshop and, and not being able to update Lightroom and Photoshop and which version of Photoshop do I have and I can't find the updates. So let's cover all of that in this video here. And hopefully if you find it useful, swing by the website, mattk.com. And I've got lots of free videos and courses and presets and that stuff. So first thing you're gonna wanna do is open your, your Adobe Creative Cloud Updater app. Okay, it's usually in your applications folder. Some people have it in a dock, wherever that happens to be, you gotta open that up, okay? If you go under all apps, you'll see all the apps that you have installed and you can see what's up to date. But what you really wanna do is go under updates. And this is gonna show you what updates are available. Now, what's happening is some people aren't seeing the newest versions of Lightroom. So this is October, 2022. So what we now have is we are up to Lightroom Classic version 12 and we're up to Photoshop version 24. Now it's called, as you can see up top here, Photoshop 2023, but the internal version is version 24. Okay, so we, we should be looking for Lightroom version 12 and Photoshop version 24. That's what we want for those two new applications. And also Camera Raw version 15 is the newest version for that if you're using Photoshop Camera Raw. Now what happens if you don't see this? Because if you see them, then it's very quick. You just click on update and it updates your applications. But what happens if you don't see this? Well, you wanna come up here and choose check for updates, okay? That will refresh and check for updates. Now, if you still don't see the updates, then you might want to consider restarting your computer. That usually does the trick, but uh, most of the time check for updates should refresh this to the point where you see that. Now, you should always check your system requirements because you might not have a computer that can support these newer versions. So uh, Google the Adobe system requirements for whatever application that you're using, make sure you meet those system and operating system requirements for that. Okay, so now you go in and you update those programs and again, they should show up in your all apps once that's all done. What the biggest or another big problem that I do see is we have an old version of Photoshop. So the first thing to do is understand that there's a difference between Lightroom Classic and Photoshop. And by the way, Lightroom, the cloud version is up to version six. So that's the one you'll wanna look for for that. So with Lightroom and Photoshop, let me open up my applications folder here. I think the big thing to understand is that Photoshop will install a whole new application folder in your applications. So you will still see your old Photoshop 2022 and then the new version 2023 will get installed as well. So when you do this, you will have two versions of Photoshop, although the Creative Cloud Updater does give you option to remove all old versions, which I would suggest you do. Once you get Photoshop 2023 going, you don't need version 2022 anymore. So you can see inside of there, there's version 2022. It's, it's a whole new folder, totally separate. Lightroom Classic, on the other hand, will overwrite itself, all right? So Lightroom Classic, will actually not show multiple versions. So you, when you go to your applications folder, you're only going to see one Lightroom Classic. You might see Lightroom CC or the cloud version of Lightroom in there, but that's not classic. Lightroom Classic will overwrite itself for each new version. And so you won't have multiple ones in there, but with Photoshop, you will. So I would suggest if you don't delete it when you install it, simply delete the folder afterwards when you're done. Also, you can go to your Creative Cloud Updater. You can see it's showing me that there's an update for version 2020 or version 23 of Photoshop. And again, remember the version, the internal version number is different from what it's called. This is the old version. Don't update it. You're not gonna use it anymore. And in fact, you can come over here to the little pop-out menu and go down and choose uninstall directly from there. So from here on out until next year, you're gonna be updating version 24 of Photoshop where when you look at the top of it or when you look at the icons inside of your application folder, it'll say 2023. That's the one that you're gonna be working with. So no longer update version 23. In fact, I would say to uninstall version 23. And then luckily with Lightroom Classic, it's just a little bit easier because Lightroom Classic uh, will just overwrite itself. So each new version you install, you'll only see one version of that. But the biggest thing is, is getting to these updates, which again, click on that little update section, make sure you check for updates. If that doesn't work, close the application, reopen it, sometimes restart your computer, and that should take care of it.